Kristina Mordek is from Mariupol, Ukraine. Her father served in the Ukrainian National Guard and died in 2022 fighting at the Azovstal steel plant. Kristina's mother spent seven months in Russian captivity. Together with 13 other children of fallen Ukrainian war heroes, Kristina got a chance to travel to the United States from Ukraine and spend two weeks in Colorado thanks to local volunteers. I love tubing. We went down the hills in these things that look like donuts. The nature is breathtakingly beautiful. I'm very grateful for this opportunity, for the emotions we got to experience here. The U.S. vacation for the 14 Ukrainian children was made possible by local volunteers from the Ukrainian community, as well as local initiatives and the local Methodist church. The idea to organize this came from one of our volunteers, a former National Guard member, who asked us to consider bringing the children of fallen Ukrainian soldiers here. The volunteers' idea took off, and the group quickly raised enough money to make it happen. We raised $25,000, though we initially aimed at $20,000, and it made us very happy. There are many sponsors and caring people. We see the kids' smiles, and we know it wasn't in vain. Anna Datsko is from Lviv. Her father died in the Luhansk region in April 2022. I love the people here. They were incredibly welcoming. We got to visit many cities here, but I loved the virtual reality museum the most. Every day there were small trips and tours. Volunteers with the Coloradans for Ukraine Foundation of Co4UA organized one outing. Today we got to go to Pike's Peak on a train. The mountain is 4,000 meters high. We'll also go to the Garden of the Gods and do a little hike there. We want to give the children a great experience. During their vacation, the children also met with the local Ukrainian community in Colorado Springs, visited the Colorado General Assembly, a mountain ski resort, and attended a couple of basketball games. I'm a huge basketball fan. I play myself, so for me, it was incredible to watch a game. Grigoryev is from Odessa. His father was gravely wounded in combat, but after a long rehabilitation process, he headed back to the front lines. Now he is fighting in Bakhmut. Many of the local families that house the children say they want to help more families and children in the future. For Svetlana Pristinska in Denver, Colorado, NRIs, VOA News.